Today we're going to talk about free education and why Joe Biden is a fucking idiot. Listen to this shit. Listen to this. L listen to how stupid this is. And Biden's proposal would triple federal spending on low-income schools, taking it from $16 billion to about $48 billion. The bulk of that money would be used to give teachers a raise. And the plan would also pay teachers for extra work if they are coaches or mentors and use also a federal program to help educators pay off their loans. Biden emphasized that he wants to help teachers receive competitive wages and benefits. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, so we're going to go from spending 16 million to 48 million, and we're going to raise the wage that teachers get. So, so, so let's break that down. And then he says, and, and then he says this. You all went out and went to college. You spent four years. You ended up with a debt. Most of you, if not all of you, and you end up in a situation where you, in fact, are making 25 percent less than most college graduates. And it's just it's just not right. So then, like, th this is how screwed up this left wing agenda is when it comes to education. So he literally just said it's fucked up that you guys graduate and then you make like 25 to 35 percent less. In other words, it's fucked up that you guys graduate with all this debt and then make even less money. Exactly. So how does this solve it? Let's break this down, you fucking idiot. Okay, so 16 million to 48 million. So we're gonna put more into the education system, which already is the US Treasury's biggest asset with $1.6 trillion in debt off the backs of 45 million college students that graduate and will make 47K per year. And we're gonna raise a teacher's salary that's averaging 60K a year as a professor to, I don't know, let's just say 80K per year, have that go around and pay the coaches and the mentors more. What are you mentoring on? This free education stuff is, it's, it's screwed up. One, it's not free. Here's what happens. Here's what happens when Bernie, when Biden say free education. This is what happens. They go, let's tax the middle class. Who's the middle class? This graduated college student only making this much money. So when they take home 30K a year, now they're gonna take home 25K a year. So now the Bernie Biden plan, now the left wing political agenda for free education plan says, well, it's free, but you're fucking paying for it, right? You got, we're gonna tax the middle class more. We're gonna squeeze them out. We're gonna take their nuts, we're gonna twist them, we're gonna extract them, put the nuts in the bank, and then use that to pay for all of this. So that way we can pay our teachers more to teach information that is paying people this much per year. The exchange of value is fucked up. It doesn't work, okay? That makes no sense. What needs to happen is this money <laughs> needs to be spent getting more qualified people to teach and getting the information that the Bezoses have, that the Zuckerbergs have, that the Elon Musks have, that the Cardones have, that the people that are actually successful, mind you, attributing none of that to college, possess. If you want to learn something and want to be paid well, then you need to learn from the people that are being paid well, doing what it is that you want to do. How can you possibly learn from an employee that is making 60K per year, soon to make 80K per year, now they're going to get paid more to teach you the same shit information that is only allowing you to graduate college with $100,000 in statistical student loan debt to make 47 k per year, to take home 30, just kidding, 25. Now that Bernie and Biden with their free education plan are making you pay more tax so they can pay the teachers this, okay? That does not make any sense. Here's what I'm getting at. Education, should you pay for it? Absolutely. I'm an educator. I'm a teacher, but the exchange of value that one gets coming through my programs is far more. Somebody pays 997 to learn Instagram Master 3.0, to receive mentorship. And they're, they're paying this to learn from somebody that's making seven figures per year with Instagram. And you are paying 35K per year to go to a four-year college, graduate with a piece of paper, have 100K in student loan debt to then work for the rest of your life, 
making 47 k per year till you can retire at 65, get a gold watch, and then continue to cash out your million dollars in your Roth IRA so you can pay yourself 40 k per year, even less than what you started with, all along paying off the student loan debt, which is transferable to your family members if you ever die, doesn't go away, and you're a slave to it. Yet over here, we've got such a big problem with uh, online education, with actually learning from people that have the results. Here, you're learning from the professor that makes an average of 72K per year. This is, this, is, this is your education. This is your traditional education. It's generalized, not personalized. This is designed to appeal to the masses. Bobby, who got a B or a C or didn't apply himself, and then Tommy and Amanda, who are A-plus students, they can get an A-plus on a multiple choice test, but they can't fucking do anything in life. They don't know about finances. They don't know about money. They don't know about taxes. I have a problem with how we have been trained and the information that we've been given and what our teachers and what our parents and what society deems as this is success. This is the information you need to be able to scale life. That is not scaling. Being 65 so you can finally retire, trading all of your time for that bullshit so you can make 40K per year, I have a problem with the education system. I have a problem with you, Joe Biden. I have a problem with you, Bernie Sanders. I have a problem with anybody saying, let's put more money, let's pay our teachers more to teach shit that our students can't actually be paid to apply at a job in real life. Let's pay people more to teach information that is not monetizable so that way our students can continue to have the same amount of debt while actually paying them less because we have to tax their ass to pay for that increase in teacher pay and now squeezing out the student more. I don't get that, okay? That is not free education. That is corrupt politics and that is somebody who does not have your best interest in mind and that is somebody who is not an entrepreneur, who can't think forward, who thinks backwards and who thinks down who doesn't get it, okay? In today's day and age, having the right information is power. Knowledge in itself is not power. Having the right knowledge and the right information, learning in the right environment from the expert is power, okay? That is power. You don't learn finance from somebody that makes $70,000 per year. You should never have your money managed by Edward Jones from Bob Jones who makes $75,000 per year as a financial advisor, who makes $90,000 per year as a financial advisor. You do not need to listen about what to do with your money from somebody who doesn't have millions and millions and millions and millions and millions of dollars, from somebody who doesn't have money, okay? A million dollars in retirement account is average, it's mediocrity. Over 25 years, that means you can pay yourself 40 grand a year. That's below the poverty level, okay? That does not make sense, all right? What does not make sense is continuing to teach people bullshit information and paying the people teaching it more money. To, that's, 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 that's by definition called a scam. A scam is where you pay for something and you get little to nothing. That's a scam. That is the college scam. That is the education scam. And shame on you, Bernie. Shame on you, Biden. Shame on anybody left-winged or right-winged that wants to pay teachers more while keeping the value or the lack of value while keeping the information being taught the same. You're going to school for marketing, for finance, for business, <laughs> yet your marketing professor knows nothing about Facebook, YouTube, Google Display Network ads, tracking, retargeting, email and chatbot sequences. You're learning finance, but the guy you're learning finance from is an employee who makes $70,000 per year. Now 80 because they've decided to tax you more and put it back into paying him. Learn from people doing what you wanna do at the level that you wanna do it at, okay? You're not gonna say, hey, Elon. Hey, what to do? Teach me. You're not gonna say, hey, Grant Cardone, start mentoring me in person. That ain't it, but you follow these people you get their programs, you buy their training, you receive mentorship from them, you soak that all up, you're gonna get far more for far less and you're gonna be able to scale. Never once was I asked, do I have a degree? Every time I was asked, can you get the results? Answer is yes. I never needed a degree to get anywhere. Never needed a degree, never needed a qualification on paper to say I'm good enough. I went to Cal Poly, I went to Purdue, I went to 
University of South Carolina. Okay, never had to do that. Don't have a college degree. Can write really well, can speak really well, can communicate really well. No business, understand finance. No taxes better than your CPA. Practice them in real life. I'm an entrepreneur. I understand what's going on in the real world right now. I understand how it applies. College is theory and multiple choice tests. SATs don't mean success in life, guys. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. Drop a comment if you've got something you want to argue with me about. Wake up America, wake up society. This is Ben over here, seven figure entrepreneur. I got a problem with this free education because free education is not free. You should pay for value, but value is not what you're getting. Wouldn't have a problem if you got value, but you're not getting value. I'm here to provide you value. Value is what I want you to get, okay? Free education is not free when you're taxing the middle class and using their money to be able to pay more and be able to raise the salary. That is displaced money. It's being displaced in the wrong direction. If you're gonna spend the money, spend it employing and getting people into the education system that actually know a fucking thing about the degree that they are teaching. Appreciate you guys. Smash the like button, subscribe. See you on the next video.